Carlos Silva, I'm an engineer and I'm a chess player too. And I will try in this video to teach you how to fix this chess watch. Now, this watch is F1 proper. In fact, they have a lot of them. But the most common is about the time button. This button here, where the players switch their times. And with usage, this button tries to fail. It doesn't stay in one of the sides. You know, you press it, the time doesn't change here because the button doesn't stay in one of the sides. So, to repair it, you just need two screwdrivers, Phillips ones. So, a medium one and a tiny one. First of all, you go to the bottom of the watch and you unscrew six screws here to separate the bottom part of the top part of the watch. Now, if you never did this, I advise you to do it in a clean place because if pieces start to fall, you can pick them easily. Don't do it in the beach, for example. One, two, three, four, five, six screws. You don't have to remove the batteries for fixing the watch. Now, once you have removed the six screws, be careful when separating the top part from the bottom part because there are wires that connect them. Those wires are for the speaker and for the batteries. So you just separate it smoothly. Don't use a hammer. Don't kick the watch on the table. Don't use explosives. Now I did it. Okay, smoothly. You see the wires? Okay. Now, I'm going to explain you what's the problem. What fixes this mechanism in the right or left place is this sphere. This sphere acted by a spring. So the idea is with usage, this piece of plastic is getting wasted and it doesn't fix the button in the right place. So we are going to remove this set, the spring with the little sphere, and we are going to add a piece of poster paper or thick plastic under to raise it a millimeter or less, compensating the problem here. Let's do it. When removing this set, you have two little black screws. Now, be very careful. Once these screws are out, all of this, the spring and the sphere, can jump out. So, do it smoothly. Be careful to don't lose any piece. Okay. We have the set with the two screws, the sphere, and the spring. Maybe you can see there are two little pins of plastic that help to fix the set in its place. We are going to cut a little piece of poster paper or not thick plastic and put it here to raise the set up. You cannot cut it very large because it won't fit between the pins, so maybe five millimeters and two centimeters long, it's enough. This little piece of poster paper or plastic is going to save a chess watch for you. Now, you put the paper between the pins. If this is not enough, you repeat the process, increasing another one. Now, you just try to put 
the set on its place again. Don't try to do this if you are drunk. You'll feel whatever works. Okay. You see it? Now, carefully, you screw again the little black screws. Can you see the final result? Now, all the sets have been raised about one millimeter. After this, you just carefully close your watch again and screw the six main screws. Let's do it. Hello, my brother is an electronic technician and he said that at all the Japanese old radios it would work better without some pieces. Now the clock is working properly. I hope this video has been helpful for you. Now you can play a chess game with your favorite friend. Isn't it right?